Andrinos, Rich and Charlie's, Bartolino's, Pasta House Company, Charlie Gito's. There's a common thread woven through every one of those iconic Italian restaurants, and his name is Tony Mazzola. Oddly enough, he doesn't have a place on the hill. Nope, Tony made his home in the Metro East. So before the coronavirus hit, Ed Herman, my buddy from Brown and Crouppen, made the trip to Collinsville, Illinois with me, and we decided we'd cross a lot more than a river to Manja at Mungo's. This is my first boss, Andrino DeSantis. I got my first job with him when I was 14 years old. We got to take care of Frank Sinatra, Michael Landon, Mitzi Gaynor, Danny Thomas. When Tony Mazzola opened his own restaurant nearly 37 years ago, he named it Mungo's. That was the nickname of his dear friend and mentor, the late Charlie Mugavero. He goes, you want to be a good bus boy? I said, yeah. He goes, keep your mouth shut, your ears open, and only work for me. I was one of his first waiters at 15 years old, and the rest is history. Tony's history and experience has made Mungo's a local favorite in the Metro East for more than three and a half decades. It might also explain how Tony seemed to know exactly which dishes we would like. Medium mudiga, pesce, veal piccata, and a uh, chicken tony. That's a canoe paddle. <laughs> That's that? how you do it. Ah, yes, yes. This is what you need in your life. Gentlemen, I think we are fully plated at this point. What do you say we go eat? I think let's go sit That's down. That's a good and... idea. Let's go. Great minds Let's think Let's go alike. manja. Manja. Now, people may be wondering who this guy is. This is my father-in-law. But you guys are actually related. That's right. Yeah. All I know is he's my cousin. This is a very popular item here. This is your pasta pesh. Pasta pesh. You got gigantic shrimp in here. Yes. Biggest scallops I think I've ever seen in my <laughs> life. What else is in there? You have fresh mushrooms, you have a little red pepper, you have a little bajamel. Amongst these things, that chicken Tony scratches me right where I am. Mm. That's right up my alley. That's just my kind of food. Do you ever eat? How come you're not eating? You don't want to eat? I've been eating this food for 54 <laughs> years. I'm tired of looking at it. I want a good steak and shake. <laughs> Oh my God, now we're talking. And believe me, oh. I saved a little room because I thought in the back of my head, maybe they got a cannoli or a tiramisu or something like that. I look behind me and it's sitting right there like they read my mind. Mm. Best part is you got some in your beard for later. Yeah, that's the beauty of the beard. <laughs> I came into this business when I was 14 years old. I never wanted to do anything else. I didn't want to be a football player, a baseball player. I wanted to be a great busboy, a good, a great waiter. And now, I get to be a great busboy again. <laughs> so good. Now listen, since Mungo's is in Illinois, right, you can't eat in the dining room right now, but they are serving carryout from 4 to 8 p.m. Thursdays through Saturdays and they could really use your support right now, like all the local eateries. Mm -hmm. Check out their Facebook page for more information. Special thanks, of course, to Ed Herman over at Brown & Crouppen for helping me cross a restaurant off my bucket list. You can reach Brown & Crouppen anytime by calling 314-222-2222 or going to getbc.com. Coming up.